A battle of words between candidates vying to unseat Governor Gavin Newsom during tonight's fourth recall debate. Good evening and thanks so much for joining us. I'm Marcella Lee. And I'm Jesse Pagan. It's the first time a Democrat joined the usual three Republicans on stage. As political reporter Morgan Reiner shows us, the candidates came ready to fight tonight. Democrat YouTuber Kevin Paffrath called out everyone on stage with an emphasis on former San Diego Mayor Kevin Faulkner. But it wasn't just the dynamics that changed tonight, some big new topics too. Three Republicans, one Democrat. I've heard a lot of complaining from my fellow candidates here, but the reality is I have not heard a plan. Ask specific questions on what they would do to handle COVID right now. We need to also include an emphasis on HEPA filtration in our schools. There's a reason our planes are still flying. The best way to do that is to educate folks to get that vaccine. Rebuild the trust that Gavin Newsom has lost. Solve the water shortage. A rationing should not be an option. And you mentioned the reservoirs are low. They were overflowing just a few years ago. Do things like desalination, recycling programs, and reservoirs. Kevin Paffrath with a jaw-dropping idea. On day one, I will declare a state of emergency to begin the construction as soon as feasibly possible of a pipeline to the Mississippi River. And with 2020 still on everyone's minds and conservative talk show host Larry Elder already casting doubt on this recall, will these candidates accept the results? Uh, yeah, I'm planning okay. on winning and I, and I can't wait. No doubt that this election has, uh, the, the scales have been tilted uh, in favor of the incumbent here. I will accept the uh, results, and uh, but I'll make it clear that I don't want all mail ballots. Would you pass a statewide system to strip police officers of their badge if they break the law? I would consider exactly what you've just asked me. If there is uh, room for criminal justice reform and police reform where appropriate. I don't believe it should be run from the state down. I don't believe in top so, down policies. So that's a no, a no on no. a statewide process. No. Okay. It's the first debate Pathrath participated in. Right now I'm beating all three of you in the polls combined. And Kevin Faulkner took quite a few hits. And my experience doesn't include ripping off my city. It's not the time for on the job training. Uh, for YouTube, somebody that's never actually had to get legislation across. Faulkner has been one of the biggest critics of conservative talk show host Larry Elder, and he would not pass up another stage to do it tonight, saying that Larry Elder is not fit to run the state, and he, Faulkner, promised to do better for women. When the moderator followed up with, what would you actually do to promote equality in the workplace? Faulkner said he plans on unveiling that later this week.